Here is part two of the Tandon floppy drive repair video. It is fixed. So I decided that the problem must be in this little 2917 chip. So I desoldered the old chip and soldered in a socket. And then I reinstalled the old chip just for confirmation. When I reinstalled the old chip, the drive still would not run at the correct speed. Removed the old chip, installed the new integrated circuit, and I found that I had plenty of control over the drive speed. Adjusting this potentiometer back and forth gave me plenty of room for adjustment, and I had no problem adjusting this drive to run at the proper speed. So just to show you, I will power it up, and you should see the outside pattern on this wheel appear to stand still. And there it is. So that's it. It's fixed. I know this is a short video, but I just wanted to let you know what the problem was and let all my viewers know that the problem is solved. Thanks for watching.